Hi, welcome to Break My Gadget, and I'll be reviewing uh, these ear cleaners with a camera. So this is the best-selling one on Amazon. It's only less than fifteen pounds, but is it any good? Does it work? You've probably seen a lot of the Instagram or TikTok videos. So let's see what you get with it, and if it works effectively very well. So first things first, what do you get with it? So the box itself, you know, is quite indiscreet. It does come with some instructions and actually very good English instructions. Um, do not use this device if you have an active ear infection, ruptured eardrum or redness. You know, so when you read some of the instructions for some of these, you know, small little electronic devices, usually it's written in very poor English, but actually the description uh, and the guidelines are actually very good, quite effective. What do you get with it? So you get the device itself, which is pretty simple. It's just got one button. It's got a USB-C um, charger on the top, and then it's got this lovely little, where is it? There you go. Lovely little scoop on the top that is a camera as well, okay? You also get um, replacement pieces. So how many are in there? There's six replacement pieces um, of these plastic coverings, obviously you can reuse them, and it says to clean them with alcohol and wipes each time. And then you, they do actually give you a USB-C cable, which is quite nice. So it's not long, but they don't give you a plug, but you can plug this into um, you know, a USB plug. It charges it. So charging it, it's very difficult to tell. I It doesn't have any indicator um, on it, whether it's fully charged or charged, but to be honest, out of the box, I've been using it for a good 10, 15 minutes, uh, and it's pretty good. And to be honest with you, that's probably about um, long enough. Um, in terms of design, yeah, like I said, really, really simple, pretty basic. Um, how it connects is via Wi-Fi. So it, ha it creates a Wi-Fi, which you then connect to on your phone or iPad. Doesn't work on a laptop, only works through um, the App Store of Apple or Google. So it won't work for any kind of Windows phones. Um, and actually, it's very good and effective um, at connecting. I thought that would be the, the point which it fell over, but actually, it's pretty damn good. Right, so let me show you what the camera looks like. Okay, so you can see my face there. And then, you know, if I zoom it in on my finger now, for example, here, you can see it's got quite good magnification there on, you know, on my finger now. Okay, if I now try and put that in my ear. The thing which, and it's not a fault of the device, is really hard, is that you, it's really difficult to tell what orientation you're in when you put it into your ear. Um, so although it's quite nice that you can see a camera view here, it is very difficult to see. See, this is me putting it into my ear. I can't film at the same time showing you it. So as you can see, you know, it focuses on the thing that's immediately in front. And that, that's one of the disadvantages is it will pick up hair or it'll pick up any kind of dust or dirt or anything like that. However, you do find, as you can see here, is that you've, you do get a clear shot, you know, every now and then within the ear canal, which is really good. And then it's up to you to be able to kind of pull the wax off. So there's no kind of tweezer that you can have, and I think that's probably a good thing, but it is really good. It's actually for 15 quid. If you feel like you've got problems with earwax, it's good to be able to look in your ears. The other thing as well with this is the battery life is pretty good. It lasts about 10, 12 minutes which is quite effective. I think overall, I, I actually, I was skeptical. I bought this to do the review, used it for a month, um, not a couple of months. And actually it's pretty good, it's pretty good. I, I wouldn't recommend um, using this effectively if you do have uh, problems with your hearing and, earing, uh, hear, hearing and ears. Um, obviously go to the doctor as a first port of call, but if you did want to just have a quick look in, it's quite effective. Um, so that's it. A link for this, this has actually got, you know, over four, four or 4.5 stars on Amazon from thousands of people, so it's pretty good. Um, a lot of people rate it. Um, and I think it does what it says, really. Okay, um, please do like, please subscribe, and thanks for watching.